Hello and welcome. In today's video, I'd like to show you this pen and this reel here. Well, it's actually not a pen, that's a pen sized rod and that's a reel which comes with it. So let us just take a normal pen and compare it. So as you can see, um, our pen shaped rod is a bit bigger uh, than the normal pen that we are used to write. But we are not here to talk about the pens, we are here to talk about uh, the rod and the reel. So the diameter um, of this rod is 1.5 centimeters or 0.6 inches. Uh, when folded, the length um, of this rod is 20.5 centimeters or approximately like 8 inches. Uh, when stretched, the length of this rod is 96 centimeters or 37.8 inches. Uh, well, uh, in my opinion, um, this pen sized fishing rod uh, would do well for situations where full size fishing gear is inconvenient. Um, it is suitable for fishing from a boat, a dam, or an ice, um, but again, um, I don't think that um, this rod and reel would do well if you will be fishing on a daily basis. And if you'll watch the video until the end, I'm gonna tell you why I think so. Uh, the best way to use it is to um, present it as a present to the person who actually loves fishing um, or to someone who actually collects um, items um, like a small items, small fishing items, um, different um, tools and gadgets. So that would do um, great as a gift. And I really think so. Um, let's just um, open it up and have a look what's inside. So as you can see inside we've got like a small rod and over here we've got five parts. So let us just um, assemble it. Yep. So the rod itself feels pretty good. It actually feels as if you can actually uh, pull out a pretty big fish with it without any issues. But okay, so we've talked a little bit about um, the rod itself. Now let us talk about the reel. Um, as you can see, it is pretty small uh, and fits pretty easily um, on my hand. Um, it is stated that um, the reel is made from aluminium alloy. But uh, when I've took it out of the box, I've noticed right away that um, these parts of a handle, uh, the spool inside, and that this part is actually made from plastic. So, well, as you probably know already, uh, the plastic isn't a good material for fishing equipment. So, in my opinion, uh, this um, reel would do well for a collector uh, so that he would put it like somewhere um, in his collection rather than taking it out um, on the test drive while you're fishing. And that is actually why I think that uh, this reel and rod would do well um, just as a gift uh, than um, as a thing that you might actually use on a daily basis. If you wish to use it on a daily basis, buy yourself a separate reel um, for the rod, uh, which is actually made from aluminum alloy, stainless steel, or any other materials that are pretty good uh, for a fishing equipment. So let me just um, assemble it so that you would have like a general understanding of how it looks like when assembled. Um, it's pretty easy to do. 
it only took me like three or four seconds and that's it um, the rod itself uh, with a reel is pretty light um, it only weights approximately like 15 or 20 grams um, even my three years old daughter is actually holding it without any issues and uh, well um, she honestly likes it and um, I don't know like when it's gonna be uh, a spring uh, we are gonna we're gonna take it for a test drive and I'm just gonna give it to her just to play with it but again um, as I've already mentioned um, as a gift to a collector or to a fisherman it would do well um, if you'd like to use it on a daily basis um, just buy yourself a separate um, reel which is made from good materials rather than this one because uh, I don't really want you to be disappointed when you will take it for a test drive try to cast for a few uh, times and it will break for you um, I know the frustration I know the disappointment because it happened to me uh, not with this rod but with the other equipments so I honestly want you not to have um, this experience and therefore I'm just warning you about well the plastic which is inside of this reel here um, so basically that's it for today's video um, if you found the content useful don't forget to like the video and you can also subscribe to the channel uh, if you'd like to support it and become a part of our community thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video